One of the biggest points of confusion for clients in my practice is why their diet, but in particular their digestion, has such a big influence on their hormone balance. So let's take progesterone production for instance. Taking about 750 milligrams of vitamin C per day has been shown to increase progesterone levels. And we know that we need progesterone to help counterbalance estrogen and it's also really important for fertility. Unfortunately, due to farming practices, a lot of the food that we eat these days is not that vitamin rich. Studies comparing fruits and vegetables from the 1950s to that of today see that vitamins overall are about 50 to 30% less now in fruits and vegetables than they were in the 50s. And this also doesn't take into account how our gut microbiome has changed significantly in that time, especially due to um, pesticides like glyphosate that are used on crops. And remember that how you digest your food dictates how well you are absorbing vitamins and minerals. Working on proper nutrition as well as digestive function ensures that you're getting the most out of your food. Buying local organic produce as well as supplements can help to fill the gap, especially in our example of vitamin C, in terms of progesterone production. So when it comes to balancing hormones, you can see why eating well and getting properly sourced fruits and vegetables as well as working on your gut health can be so phenomenally helpful for your hormone balance.